Hi, future scholars. This is Mentor Peachy. Welcome back. For this segment, we will be discussing adjectives, adverbs, prepositions, conjunctions, and subject verb agreement. In this way, not only will we be able to ace the language proficiency portion in OPCAT, but also be an effective English speaker and writer. Ready na ba kayo? Tara! Okay, for this item, we are looking at the order of adjectives. Now, for this one, it's important to remember this acronym, DQOSASCOM. Okay, let me just write that down. That's DQOSASCOM. Okay, with this acronym, it would be easier for us to write down the adjectives in order that would make it sound more coherent and natural. Okay, so D means determiner, Q is for quantity, O is for opinion, S is size, A is age, S is shape, C is color, O is origin, M is material, and P is purpose. Now, let's go back to the item, and we have three adjectives here. We have several, lavish, and big. So, several is actually a quantity, lavish is an opinion, and big is the size. So going back to our acronym, if we look at it, the correct order would be letter D, several, lavish, and big. So again, it's important that if you do not recall even the whole acronym, just memorize at least three to four qualities or three to four letters to guide you when we encounter questions like these. So similar with the previous item, we're still looking at the order of the adjectives. So again, we have the acronym DQOSASCOM. Now in this item, we do have four adjectives to look at. So we have massive, meaning uh, this is the size. Sorry, let's put that S. Then new, this is the age, so that's A. Then black is the color. Then five is the quantity. So again, DQO SASCOM, the correct answer here would be C. So the five massive new and black trucks were loaded. Okay, so again, just a tip, always memorize or at least try to memorize three to four of the letters from the acronym just to guide you and hindi kayo malito when it comes to these um, questions. Okay, for our next item, we are looking at the comparative degree of adjectives. All right, so our main clue here is the phrase second time around. Yeah, second time around. That means that there was already a first time that happened or there was already a first time that we can compare to. So because of that, we are looking at the comparative degree of the adjective. So if we recall the degrees, right, there's the positive, comparative, and super superlative, sorry. So in normal or in common adjectives, we just add ER and EST at the end of the adjectives. But then there are those cases that we change the spelling. So, for example, we have, right, great, greater, greatest, that's for the common adjectives. Then we have little, less, and least for those that change the spelling. So, in this item, the correct answer here would be A, worse. Because if we look at the adjective, it starts with bad, then worse, then the last is worst with the T at the end. Okay, so I think that's a common mistake that most students might make. They would answer C, which is worst, but that is the superlative adjective. So again, the correct answer here is A. Next item, again, order of the adjectives. So similarly with before, the acronym DQOSASCOM. Now, for this item, we are looking at three adjectives. We have silk-like, which is an opinion. Then we have long, which is the size. Then we have black, which is the color. So following the acronym, the correct answer here is 
D. So her silk-like long black hair makes every girl in the town jealous of her. So again, tip here is just to remember at least three to four letters from the acronym to help you out when it comes to these kinds of items. Next item, you're looking at the comparative degree of adjectives. Now, here our main clue is than usual. So again, there's that interpretation that most flights of Naomi are always late. So again, there's something that we can compare to. So what we are looking at here is the comparative degree. Now, the um, positive adjective here is early. So we're looking at the second one. And the correct answer here would be D, earlier. Okay, because that's early, earlier, earliest. Some of you might have answered A, more early. I mean, while it might be grammatically correct, still the correct answer here or the better answer here would be D, earlier. Do take note that in the OCAT, when we look at the choices, it might be look like there are lots of like correct answers but always take note to choose only the best answer all right for this item we are looking at the adverb of manner so adverbs as we know is used to describe a verb adjective or another adverb so for this item specifically our main clue here is doing the teenager's hair black so, in what manner does the salon do the teenager's hair? So, the correct answer for this would be B, impeccably. So, the salon near the school is famous for doing the teenager's hair impeccably. Manner, time, place, frequency, and degree. So similarly with the order of adjectives, it's best that you memorize at least two to three of these items just to guide you whenever you encounter questions related to the order of adverbs. Okay, for our next item, we are looking at the correct order of adverbs. Now, if we look at the sentence here, we are looking at the word pray specifically. So this is the verb and it should be followed by an adverb that um, describes how or what is the manner of praying. Then after that, it should be followed by the place, then the frequency. So looking at our options, the correct answer here would be letter A. So with the first letter here is solemnly. So that is the manner of how the convents pray. Then that is then followed by the place, which is the altar, and the time or the frequency, which is every morning. So again, the correct answer here is letter A. So similarly with adjectives, there's also the correct order of adverbs. So that is manner, like how it is being done, the place or the location, frequency, time, and purpose. So same tip with the order of adjectives. Try to remember or try to memorize at least two to three of those items just to help you out again with these kinds of items.